fighting general elections, faster approaches. Many groups like the European Centre for Electoral Support are organizing rallies such as this to educate Nigerians on the need for a peaceful, free, fair and credible poll. The start-up point was around the Wusi market in the nation's capital and then a brief walk into the market. Men, women, youths, people living with disability were also well represented. This was done to show inclusiveness during the elections. The visually impaired, you know, voters are going to vote using the Braille ballot guide for the presidential election. Election day written instruction for the deaf and the magnifying glasses for people with low vision and people with albinism and also a sign language interpreter during collation and announcing of results. The message as displayed in various placards carried by participants during the walk was conveyed to traders in the market in various languages. Still they have to just continue uh, to continue to encourage people to collect the PVC. Our PVC is our power and we must vote right. We must vote not selling our vote because if you sell your vote, you sell your future. This is very, very important. I want everybody to take it very seriously because we need to stay alive to even govern the people. Going by what we saw in Oshun, INEC uh, had already put in place facilities or deployed uh, facilities for persons with albinism and visually impaired to be able to vote. And I hope I know we'll be able to deploy the same. The European Centre for Electoral Support, in collaboration with other groups, also took the sensitization to the outskirts of the nation's capital and some parts of neighboring Nasarawa State. From Abuja, Chinamaran, Joseph, STV News.